Okay, so hi everyone. My name's Ashley and my nursing student was Allison. And then my, um, if she wants to introduce herself actually. Hi, I'm Allison. And then my nursing student, was, or not my nursing student, sorry. My South Coast rep was Sydney. Hey. <laughs> so then um, the location is Charlton Memorial Hospital. It's located in Fall River. Um, this is actually the existing conference room that I redesigned. So um, we are looking into studies, what works best inside of the hospital. And then if my nursing student wants to take over and talk a little bit about the research. Yeah, so um, the majority of the research that I looked into because Ashley's idea is to have some sort of like smoothie bar um, slash like healthy eating um, place because nurses usually or healthcare workers in general don't have time to take adequate breaks. Mm. Um, so your grab and go stuff is like whatever you can pull out of the vending machine, which is usually a Snickers bar or some kind of chip that's like really unhealthy. Um, and I think it comes down to like your patients kind of want you to practice what you preach. So if you're caring for somebody and you're saying like, you can't, you shouldn't be eating this and like, maybe you should do this or your diet, it's kind of off, um, they don't want to see you sitting behind the desk eating a Snickers bar if you just got out of their room saying that stuff. So um, to just encourage uh, better eating, like be healthier eating, and for nurses and healthcare staff to actually take the adequate breaks, um, you're going to improve the overall health, not only of your patient outcomes, but also your staff as a whole, hopefully less call outs and sick time and, you know, that sort of thing. So I just think that it improves the, um, Ashley's idea just improves like the overall health and well being of the staff as a whole. Um, and then also too, and I'm not sure if it's down farther, um, but it was like inclusive, like in the space is adding some sort of like um, alternate therapy, like aromatherapy or music therapy, picture therapy, um, stuff that we so frequently tell our patients to engage in, but uh, we ourselves don't necessarily take the time for us to do that. Um, so I feel like injecting that into the hospital environment in this space and making it um, something that the healthcare staff actually get to experience, they would be able to give better education to their patients as to why it would be beneficial for them to engage in things like that as well. Yeah, so, yeah, so then our sources are also listed at the bottom. So, um, Pretty much just going what she said. So um, yeah, we just kind of saw like a grab and go as a perfect solution within the space. So we, if we go down a little further, you can see the floor plans to the left. So you just enter in through the doors, which we added double doors within the space. Um, and then also too, we added a little window within the area because um, definitely want to implement grab and go. So because the space is a little bit smaller, we wanted to make sure that there was outside access too as well. So you can go up to the counter, you can ask for a specific juice and then you can get it. Or um, we do want to implement uh, another idea was a juice of the week. So pretty much every week would have like a new flavor of juice. Um, and then you can go up to the counter. They would have like multiple of this flavor juice, smoothie, whatever it is for the week and then you can grab it and then you can go and continue on with your day. Um, and then you continue to walk throughout the space. So you can see in the right per hand perspective um, that there's like water jugs, you can go in, grab a cup and you can fill your cup up and then you can leave. But that also has like fruit in it and it has like all the necessary vitamins to stay healthy as well. Um, and then we really just wanted the space to feel light so we added a lot of light materials um, so you can go in there and not feel like you're so much in a hospital, but it has a little bit of color and fun to it. Um, so that's why we had a lot of, a little bit of pattern and lighter materials. So then on the um, right hand side of the floor plan, you can see the counter. So that's where like underneath would have storage, would have a, there's a fridge in there as well, which you'll see in the bottom perspective. 
Um, and you can go and you can make your own smoothie. Um, you can have someone like help you make a smoothie. So that's kind of fun and a fun way to incorporate that as well. So then to the right hand perspective, you can see that there's like fruit options available, um, some packaged, some not. And then there's also gloves right next to it as well because COVID-19 is still a thing. So we don't wanna forget that. So there are gloves that are um, stored right next to it. So you can get your gloves, you can get a little bag and you can take your fruit to go. Um, kind of like a vending machine, but not so much. Um, but a healthier option. Mm -hmm. And then where you see the papers hanging up on the board, uh, we thought it'd be a really cute idea to include daily affirmations. So um, you can leave little notes for other nurses passing through the space, or you can um, make suggestions for the next week, like the next juice. So if you think, oh, I want a coconut juice next week, then you can add that there. And then that can be a good option for someone to incorporate the following week. And then if we scroll down a little bit, it's just another perspective of the room. You can see the counter, the fridge that's there, um, more juice, like the necessary materials you need to create juice. So there's like a blender back there. And there's um, also granola bars, health bars, like all kinds of different healthy options for food as well. Um, and then, yeah, and then you can just see the daily affirmations thing still there. Um, so yeah, and there's also a fridge in the space. So there's other necessary requirements, but yeah. So that concludes our presentation. I'm open to any comments, questions, or concerns. Um, I actually have a question for you. Sure. Um, I'm Diane, I'm the resource nurse on uh, at Withrig Charlton. Um, as far as the blender, um, when, you, when you're done making the juice, um, mm -hmm. how would we like kind of like rinse it out or like, you know, to get another one going or whatever? Yeah, so um, currently I'm doing a little bit of research on adding a sink to the space. Okay. And because of necessary plumbing and all of those things. So I am looking into adding a sink or seeing what's available. Also to the okay. cafeteria is right next door. So um, there is sinks available in that space as well. So yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. I Thank have you. a question. Um, great job, you guys. Um, I think this looks really, um, it looks really just fresh and modern, I guess. Um, my question is the window option that you talked about, um, maybe you could talk a little bit more about that. Um, if somebody comes up to like the window, like who would be on the other side of the window handing stuff to the staff? Like how do you, how do you envision, like who's gonna be staff this? Yeah, so someone could be maintaining it. So, or it could just be like a night before thing. Someone could um, make some juice if they wanted, they could bring it in. And then when it runs out, it kind of like runs out, but they could, people could come get some samples. Like they could be smaller size samples. Um, they could be larger size. It'd be really up to the hospital. Um, so pretty much it was just like in uh, something that was included. So that way the overall population within the space and occupancy, it wouldn't get too overbearing. So mm -hmm. there was some selection outside of the space. Okay, thank you. Um, Ashley, you didn't mention, which I thought was such a good idea, that maybe you could do a promotion for South Coast with juice bottles and that they would be a get part of your giveaway to launch. Oh yeah. That Did would be I miss that? No, that would be another thing. So we do have like a lot of um, other options in the space. So to with the grab and go, there could be like little South Coast cups um, and stuff like that that could be incorporated as well. So yeah, stuff. as the refill center, I remember having that conversation with you, and I thought that was <laughs> <a good idea. laughs> yep. Great, thank you so much, team. Team, um, where are you guys? You guys are actually. Team four. <laughs> uh, I actually have to go get my son from school. So this works out perfect. But great job, guys. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank, Thank you. you. Okay. I'm